In this video, we're going to walk you through how to set up the ScreenBeam 1000 EDU Gen 2 receiver for the best user experience. First, let's connect this HDMI cable to the ScreenBeam receiver HDMI output. Next, if you have an Ethernet network cable connection, plug that into the Ethernet port of the screen beam. Network is optional, but it's highly recommended if you want to use Miracast over the network or AirPlay screen mirroring or Chromecast mirroring. If you have an interactive touch panel, use the USB Type-A to Type-B connection. On the screen beam side, you want to connect the type A connector. On the touch screen or interactive panel, you want to use the type B connector and connect to the same port next to the HDMI input. Last, plug in the power and your screen beam is powered on. You can verify this by the LED light. It takes about a minute for the screen beam to boot up. Once it boots up, then you should have the instruction on the screen. Thank you for watching this video.